Reese, just before we look ahead to tomorrow's game against Portsmouth, um, this is the first time we've caught up really since you joined us. How, how have you been settling that down here in Exeter? Yeah, no, it's been brilliant. Obviously, um, got pre-season out of the way, which is always nice to see the back end of and then excited to see the start of the season and, and it was a good start on the first day and then straight into another game on, on the Tuesday against Crawley. Obviously, we got the win and then a point on Saturday, I think um, everyone's quite happy with. Like you say, that's the, the the three games we've had. It's been, for most parts of each game, three really good performances. You must be. Are you enjoying playing as a part of this size at the moment? Yeah, no, definitely. I've I've played a dip, couple of different roles, which um, I've quite enjoyed in in the roles that I've played. Um, I felt that I've affected the games in one way or another, which which I've enjoyed doing, and hopefully I can affect the game tomorrow. And how are you finding League One as a whole early on? Yeah, no, it's good. Obviously, the standard's very good. Some very, very good players in the league. Um, but from our performances, I think you can see that we've actually got a really, really good group. And I think we'll, we'll kick on and do quite well this season. And did, you, did you say you've played in a couple of positions early on? Did, did you find either one of those more preferable? Or, or are you just happy to be on the pitch? I, ultimately, happy to be on the pitch. But... Um, yeah, no, I, I like both positions that I've been playing, but obviously 10, I'm, I'm higher up, I'm closer to goal and I can hopefully get my shots off, although I didn't even have a shot on Saturday. But think you were too close, weren't you? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so I should probably stop passing it and start shooting. So, But yeah, no, I enjoy both roles. Um, it's good. They've both got their pros and cons, So, but I'm just enjoying ultimately being on the pitch and helping the team. Of the... The first four league games, you know, three would have been away, yeah. which is, is not always the easiest start. But how much do you think pre-season will have helped that? Obviously, we only played one game at home in pre-season. Yeah, no, obviously, when, when you, you play away in, in pre-season, it's, it's good to obviously not be at home and you've got to go to sometimes not as nice as stadiums, which we're going to get in the league. Obviously, Pompey's going to be a, a good ground to go to. It's always a fixture you probably look out for in League One. So, um, yeah, no, it's it's... It's one we're all looking forward to, I think. Portsmouth do look a real force early on this season. Yeah. I think a great 4-0 win against Leighton Orient on Saturday. I'm, I'm sure, if you haven't already, you'd be looking at clips of that and, and sort of finding out how to, how to tackle that. Yeah, no, obviously we'll go through all our analysis stuff to, to see what they do well and what they don't do well, where we can catch them out. So hopefully we'll see a couple of things and we can implement that in the game tomorrow night. And as far as atmospheres goes, Portsmouth probably have one of the best in the league. So it, they're going to make it a real difficult place for us to play tomorrow, aren't they? Yeah, no, it is. But obviously, as as players, you know, you've got to block that out and forget about what's what's being said and what's what's going on, and just try and get the three points. Are you one of those players that picks up on crowd noise, or are you one of those that just likes to, to block it all out as much as you can? Uh, I'd say I do when I do something wrong in, in terms saying. of like a tackle <laughs> or something like that. I'd, I sort of thrive off that and getting them off their seats. Um, but obviously, it's, you just you forget about it, get on with your game and, and hopefully try and stick one in the back of the net. And how easy is it to forget that the game's actually live on telly? Because I can imagine it's probably in the back of, the, back of your mind somewhere and you just need to, to forget about that. Yeah, it's, it's one of those ones. You'd, obviously, before the game, obviously you've got more cameras there and things like that, but it makes no difference to it. You've just got to go out there and perform to the best of your ability and hopefully all of us do that and it'll get us the three points tomorrow. Imagine there's a f few new haircuts for tomorrow? Yeah, I think so. Not <laughs> me yet. I might have to text the barber and see if I can get him later, but um, if he can't, I'm going to have to go like this. And actually, it's an opportunity, I think, for us to, to show a wider audience yeah. what, what we're all about and, and the style of play that, that the manager's trying to implement. Yeah, no, definitely. It's, you could see on Saturday, it was very patient. It was sort of like a game of chess in the first half, I thought. And... Um, They've come down from the championship and that's, I think that's them showing us a lot of respect in, in the way that we play. So definitely I think tomorrow is going to be a very, very good game.